All right, so video number two, we're gonna do what's called the French press, and the street name for this is called Skull Crushers for a reason. If you bring the bar down onto your forehead, yeah, it's gonna hurt. So I'm gonna show you uh, a safe way and then also a controlled way. So French press, here we go. You want a comfortable weight. You don't want to really be hurting your back on this, but this, this should be a very comfortable weight. Bring it up, hands are together. You don't have to be white knuckling this, but you know, a nice grip. And we're just gonna bring it down to the forehead gently and just straight up. Okay, you want your elbows in. You don't want them flared out, okay? You want them in. You want the pressure on your tricep. Okay, we're not locking. We're just coming up. Okay, so alternative is we're bringing the weight behind or out over the top of the head, and this way you protect your um, your head from getting crushed. Since the name is also called Skull Crushers, we don't want to do that. So here we go. Down and up. So basically, I'm just bringing it over the top of my head gently keeping my elbows in. Okay, and to finish off, we're gonna do a close grip press down, keeping our elbows in. Notice I'm not gripping, white, there's no white knuckling. The bar is just resting on my hands, cradling. And I do a thumb wrap around on these. So this is a nice chest and tricep finisher. Skull crusher. Make sure the bar is safe. And we dismount. Okay, so the the nice thing about these is you can really isolate on the tricep, but in fact, we're only in one hand position. All right, we're in actually in position number three. So we wanna also think about position number two and position number one. And I will show you those positions on the next video with dumbbells.